Hello everybody, welcome back to Stardew Valley, where today, as you can see, it is raining, so I don't have to water all the crops and all that, but one main thing that I'm going to be doing today is actually going to try to go fishing, because we still need that uh, seaweed to actually go ahead and, well, make that fishing pond, not, not fishing pond, little, actually, is it a fishing pond? I can't remember, but what we need is that uh, algae. I'll take this leak so I can get a little bit of extra energy. Now, I've already sold off all of the uh, crops for harvest today. So that should be some pretty good income when I end up sleeping tonight. So, let's go ahead and try to get some good old seaweed. Shouldn't be too hard, right? Alright. So basically the plan for today is to get the seaweed and try to go and get some coal so that I can get a few more upgrades as well as possibly another preservatives jar because I uh, sold everything off without realizing hey I could go ahead and put one of these into the preservative jar. Don't know how I forgot that I even made it but hey I did. So let's see what I can get over here. Should be fairly easy to find seaweed. There's some right there. Hmm. Also, I was looking at a few of the achievements, and I think there's a few that we could possibly get. Oh, and there's some seaweed. How much did we need, though? I feel like it wasn't one, but I feel like you needed one seaweed, one algae, and some wood and stone. Let me go up and check with Robin. Because uh, I actually completely forgot what we needed for this. And for all I know, we could actually build it now and just start like grabbing some fish row. But also, I think fairly soon we're going to be hopping into the next season here. Which should be fairly good. We can start growing a bunch of new plants. And... Hopefully we can start moving on to getting some animals as well. Maybe a bit expensive for animals right now, but uh... Hello there, I would like to uh, construct farm buildings. Yeah, the fish pond. Oh, we needed five seaweed and five algae. Okay. That should be good. Let's go on ahead and try to get that seaweed today. And I think we are also missing a bunch of algae. So we should probably get that done as well. I'm not sure where the best place to get algae is. Hmm. There's probably going to be some down in the cave somewhere. Actually, don't the slimes drop like white algae? But that's not what we need though. Hmm. Yeah, basically, today's going to be another cave dive, hopefully, after we get all of the seaweed needed. I'm not sure what actually gives me the best chances of getting seaweed. Maybe if I just do this. Maybe I'll have better chances. Hmm. Well, anyways. I guess, uh... going to wait for that to pop up something. Hmm. Alright, so there's one seaweed. Maybe if I just don't put any power into it at all. It's because my uh, fishing level is so low as well. Oh, nope, that's an actual fish. With treasure, I see. Don't mind if I do. You are a sardine with... A rusty spoon. I love having rusty spoons. Why did I do that? I'm trying not to get good things. I want seaweed. <laughs> Alright. And... Catch. Yeah, okay. Oh, it is a, it's another fish. Hmm. So... We got a herring. Nice. Again, I don't know why I charge it up at all. 
I feel like you should be able to grab some seaweed from that right there. I mean, I don't think he's gonna mind. Alright. So... Do we have anything? There we go. Seaweed. Nice. So I just need to not put any power into it. And then we'll get everything that we need. And move on. Alright. So... No, I have... Is there no shop that sells seaweed? Hmm. Oh, another fish. So, with all this, hopefully we can actually get the pond within today. Or maybe within this video, hopefully. But, uh, yeah. Because once we get that pond, it should be a decent form of money. At least until winter. Winter, they stop producing. A sardine. Again. To make sure that it has no power behind it. What was that? That was a really weird noise. <laughs> Alright. Why is it that I always hear the weird noises on rainy days in Stardew? If anyone knows what those noises are, just go ahead and let me know in the comments, because I am... I've been royally confused by them ever since I started playing. Alright. Anything gonna show up? Hmm. Come on, there's gotta be some seaweed down here. wonder if it, like, increases your chances if you fish in a spot with seaweed. I should probably check the shop right there for seaweed after I'm done with this fish. First things first, can I collect anything from here? Answer is no. Whop right back at ya. Alright. So no, this man does not sell seaweed. Alrighty. I'm gonna try fishing in a seaweed spot now. Nope, wrong direction. There we go. It's gotta have some seaweed in it, right? Alright, now what we gotta do is... Wait for a fish, apparently. And... Gotcha. A sardine. And... What else do we got? Come on, there has to be some seaweed here. And... nope. Fish. Hmm. Nope, come on. I've never been the best at these fishing minigames. Alright, sardine. Any uh, seaweed, possibly? Hmm. Maybe I should have gone for the moss first. Because it's already 4 p.m. in game. Oh. And. What do you know, fish? Of course, all these are just lowest quality, because I'm not putting any strength behind the rod here. Alright, so... Honestly, I thought I'd get the seaweed a lot quicker with how fast we were getting it earlier. Nope, okay. Whoa. Quick little guy. I would like to catch you, whatever you are. Please, I'd like to catch you. Alright. Come on. Okay, this guy's just... zipping around there. Alright. An eel? It wasn't that... 
Wasn't that for something? No. Right way, come on. This way. I feel like that was for one of the, uh... One of the bundles, wasn't it? Come on, can I please get some seaweed? Alright, have a good day, buddy. Bye! And nope, I get another fish. Maybe I should come back here during the day. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and nab this and head back to the house. After I check what we have here. Because I think... Was it river fishing? No. Crab pot, night fishing. Yeah, it was night fishing. Nothing else? Alright. So we'll save the eel for uh, next... Actually, we can probably deposit it in the fish tank before we go. For those Juminos. Not walk through the little cemetery there. Let's head up here. And go ahead and put away the eel. We'll sell the anchovy and the uh, sardines, as well as the herrings. Actually, we may want to keep a pair so that we can actually use the fish pond when we get it. Alright. Nope, wrong thing, but we do actually have an item for it, so hey. Night fishing, gonna plop that right in there. Alright. How much seaweed do we have at home? I feel like if we have enough at home, we could probably just go ahead and continue on with the video here. But, I should probably also donate the rusty spoon a little bit later. Because there is an achievement for donating a lot of stuff to the uh, museum. I feel like that one is very possible very soon. If I keep finding stuff, that is. Okay, so we have four algae and no... None of the uh, seaweed. So we still need two more seaweed. We'll sell all these. So, seaweed it is. Let's see what we got here. Weather report. Frost cloudy, light breeze, lots of pollen. Gotcha. Let's see how much we get for this. Wow, lots. Nice. And this is the 27th of spring. If I'm not mistaken, we are about a day away from the next uh, season. Care about the watering can. And go and get a nice refill. Hello there. Oh, nice! Got some money. Got some cash money. And some parsnips. And I think I'm going to go ahead and turn one of those strawberries into jam. Nope, I don't want to eat it. I want to pick all of these. And come back in here. And toss one of them into there. I think that turns into jelly. I'm not sure. It could turn into jam. Alright. So I'm not going to replant anything in the fields down there. Because uh, it is one day until the next season. So it, it would just die. I can get all those watered. Sell those. And head back out, because we still need two more seaweed. And one more algae. Hmm. There has to be a better way to get the algae, right? Hmm. Well. First things first is seaweed. Then, let's go ahead and hop into the caves and see if we can find anything cool down there. 
Alright. So hopefully we can just go ahead and fish up the two seaweed like we did before. Ooh. An oyster. Nice. And can I get something here? Seaweed. Now. Uh, I guess not. How about now? But now I'm just looking dumb. Wow, okay. Apparently it worked, though. Alright, so now we just need one more. And that's a fish. And what is it? It is easy to catch. Sardine. Cool. So, come on, seaweed. Alright. If I'm not mistaken, you can get some uh, algae from some of the creatures. And that is another fish. Fish with a treasure chest, though. I don't think we're getting either. I almost missed both there, my goodness. Alright, get that guy up to there. Collect that. And... That should be a win. Nice. A flounder. With a geode and some coal. Wow. That was actually one of the goals for today, to get some coal. So we wanted to make another preservatives jar. Alright. And can I get that last seaweed? The world may never know. Alright. And... Seaweed. Nope. Fish. Alright. Oh, but I got it perfect, though. Ooh. A halibut. Nice. I don't think I fished up one of those before. Alright. So... Oh. I was hoping we got that last seaweed there. Alright. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to catch this fish because this thing is zooming. Maybe I can get it. I'm thinking that's a yes. That's another halibut. I'm guessing these would sell for a lot. Alright. And... Catch. Alright. Not seaweed, again. You know, normally people wouldn't want seaweed, and they're just going for the fish. I am here just for the seaweed. Alright. So, can I please get that seaweed? It's probably going to look really dumb in the recording, just me sitting here asking for seaweed. I hope next episode's going to be a little bit more exciting for everyone watching. I'm probably going to record it, actually, right after this one, so you guys don't have to wait long. All the Stardew enjoyers. If I could please get some seaweed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna really quickly go and check something. Bear back, everybody. All right. So supposedly I've been doing this all wrong. Apparently I can actually find uh, seaweed and green algae in trash cans. So as long as nobody sees me while I go through trash, I should be fine. All right. He didn't see me. Nobody's over here, right? Alright, hello? Alright. Nope. Nothing there. There's a possibility that somebody sees me and is just, like, disgusted, but... Seaweed, everybody. Alright, those guys all left. Ah, oh, but there's those two over there. Dang. Okay. So, it looks like we are... 
out of luck right now. Hmm. There is that one there. I don't think anybody comes out of here. Nope. Alright. Well, while we're here, let's go ahead and donate. I would like to give you one rusty spoon, please. Please, and thank you. Alright. May as well check this one, too. Oh, I can't keep checking it. Okay. Makes sense. I think those only generate stuff once per day. So if there's not anything there, then you just don't get it. Hmm. Well, apparently you could also forage for them on the beach. So let's try to repair that bridge. Didn't it only need, like, 200 wood? I think I can do that. Let's go and check and see how much wood we actually have. So I just need one more seaweed right now. And from the looks of it, there wasn't any on the beach. So, oh, and we also have an oyster to go in and put uh, into the fishing tank. First, let's go in and sell all these fish. And then put the geodes and coal away. And it looks like we do have enough uh, wood. So I'll put that there. And let's go and try to repair that uh, bridge. Then we can go in and get a lot of collecting done on the other side. And then hopefully there is some seaweed over there, and then we can hop into the dungeon. Because supposedly, uh, very, very deep down in the cave, there is the ability to get uh, some of the seaweed and algae, I think. I think on the algae part, I know on the seaweed part. Alright. Let's head over here and rebuild. Hello there, buddy. Alright. A 300. Oh, I'm short. Oh, no. Uh, hmm. I guess then let's head back and chop down some trees. Okay, can I please move? Thank you. I need to be speedy about this. So I can actually get it repaired and check everything before nightfall. Alright, so let's get over there, and chop down some trees. Shouldn't be too difficult, we have tons on the farm, and even some not on the farm. From the looks of it, maybe three trees ought to do. Alright, better head in here and nab my axe. Alright. So let's go on ahead and grab all that. Alright. Where was the one that I put the tap on? Right there. Okay. So, let's go ahead and take three trees down. Rebuild that. Search for any seaweed. Any seaweed would be fine at this point. So I literally just need one. So close to getting it. Let's go ahead and chop this one. And probably two more. Two more maximum. Alright. Looks like we are going to cut down this one here. And I think we're going to be done with that. Nice. 308. We won't have enough to build anything else in the near future, but hey. We can build a bridge. Alright. So. With all of that, I'll try not to drink the sap because that, uh, <laughs> that's not good. So let's get out there, check for any seaweed. I think out there there's also a little bit of a kind of pier off into the off into the ocean a little bit. All right. 
Hello there, buddy. So let's get over here and build this. Yes. Awesome. Now we've got some coral. Got some sea urchins. More coral, more sea urchins. I got a clam. Nice. Does not seem to be any seaweed though. Which sucks royally. But here's that little pier that I was talking about. I'm going to toss these into the trash for right now. Because I still want to try to get that one last piece of seaweed today. Come on, just need one more piece. Anything? Yes! Alright. And that is the seaweed requirement completed. Let's get back home, sell all these clams and coral, and yeah. Then all we gotta do is get that one last algae, and then we can get that started for the next season here. What? Cutscene. Ooh. Wonder what he found in there. I don't think it's a raccoon. Hi there. Hmm. I don't want to scare him. He's just looking for food. I feel bad for him. There we go. I feel like I should go in and like give him some food. I mean, I am literally growing plants. Poor guy. Aw. Gus is a nice guy. Aw. That's just nice. Right, now I gotta walk home with all the stuff. <laughs> I got completely distracted from what I was doing. <laughs> I feel like there should be like some sort of option to donate food to Linus. I mean, I could always gift him food. We're definitely going to need that kitchen upgrade eventually. Well, first things first, we have to get the fish pond going. So, let's go ahead and sell all of these. Not to the seaweed, the precious seaweed that we need. So there's the five there. We need one more green algae. And then I think we are set. Let's see what the weather's like. Clear and sunny. Can I pet him? Yes. Alright. Let's go to bed. Level up in fishing. Got a crab pot. And lots of foraging stuff. Alright. This is the last day of spring, if I'm not mistaken. I'm sitting pretty at 7,000 buckaroonies. I don't think any of these are going to be growing in. It's all about yeah. Do we have 
have a calendar in here? We should. Well, I'm not sure if I'm going to get any more use out of these, so I may as well water them one last time. Before it kicks over into summer, if I'm not mistaken. And then we're going to have to start growing some more plants like watermelons, pumpkins. This should all be fun to get. Alrighty. Let's get all this set up for its last day here. And let's head out to get that one last piece of algae. And then we can go ahead and get that started. And probably go down to the mines a little bit and grab some iron. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and end off today's episode. So. Let's see if I can even get any of the algae. I mean. Alright. Thought I'd give it a try. So I think I can get the seaweed in the pond. No, not seaweed. Jeez, the algae up at the pond up here. And I just need one more. Let's hope I don't fish up like a shoe or something. Alright. Maybe I can get some crab pots going at some point. And just hope and pray that they actually pick up something. I'm not mistaken, there's the green algae. Wow, that was really quick. Alright, so now that we've got everything, I'll go ahead and give everything to Robin, and then let's head down into the mines. Alright. And that should take maybe a few days to go ahead and get ready. But it should for sure be ready next episode. So, that's going to be a fun little upgrade. I should probably put it over here by the house somewhere. So let's... Oh, none of the stuff that I need in there. Whoops. Alright. Algae. Needed stones as well. Alright. Actually, no, I did need stuff from in here. I was going to swap out my tools that I have... For the sword, pickaxe, scythe. For going down into the mines. And hopefully that jelly is done by the end of today as well. Alright. So let's go on ahead and build this thing. And then get a roll into the mines. Because we still have a lot of mining stuff to get done. So we need enough coal to make... Uh, another preservative jar, an iron ingot, and a copper ingot. If I'm not mistaken, let me check what we got here. Uh, where is it? There's a construction bundle. Fall foraging, exotic. Okay, so not there. Which one was it? Yeah, here at the blacksmith bundle. And we need the adventurer's bundle, so we need solar and void essence still. And we need a frozen tier and fire quartz. So all of those come from the underground stuff. Why did I come in here? I was heading up to see Robin, that's right. <laughs> I don't know why I stepped into the <laughs> into the community center. Probably because I was just checking the stuff and it was on my brain at the moment. So, let's head in here, give her the stuff, and then head down to the mines. Construct. One fish pond, please. I would like it right about... No, let's put it here for now. We can move it at a later date. Alright. So that should be ready how long? Oh, it doesn't tell us now. Okay. Can we buy a calendar from her? Yes. Alright. That is an expensive calendar. But you know what? That'll be helpful. So I'm taking it. And I'm going to head down into the mines for a little bit of digging. And then place the calendar once we get back home. Hi there, buddy. So. Hopefully we can find some decent stuff here. I feel like coal is more abundant around Area 10, isn't it? 
forts. That's nice. You don't mind me coming through here. All right, so we do have one of the Diglett creatures. That's not the best. But I need coal. Oh, well, there's that. Nice. I thought I heard the buzzing of that little ambush thing again. But nope, I'm just hearing things. Got some coal, got some copper. Let's see what else we got. Alright. Some good amount of stones down here. And... Looks like we're only going to be getting around one copper here from this floor. Oh, nope. Not this guy again. Get out of here. Out of here. Go. Go away. Now. Please. And thank you. Alright. Take care of all this rock down here. I think it's going to attack me down here, right? Is it stuck up there in the big dirt area? Hmm. Let's go on ahead and nab all of this. Since we did just spend around 200 stones, it's probably best to go in and refill. Oh, nice. A... That's an earth crystal, right? I don't need bug meat right now. I'm not going on a massive expedition. Expedition. Jeez. Alright, I think that's everything. Let's head on down to the next floor. Alright, we have more bugs. There we go. Let's go ahead and dig. Alright, ladder to the next floor. Grab all of this. This thing is going to try to kill me. Alright. You can go away. Slime out. Alright. I'm not going for monster materials as it is right now. Right now it's just coal is the main objective. Alright. Take that guy down. Let's go ahead and dig up all of this. And I don't think I got enough inventory space for that. This is just a topaz, right? Yeah. Well, I can get rid of some fiber. I got enough fiber in my diet. So let's come down here. And grab all that. Another ladder, okay. I'm liking how fast it's giving me the exits. Alright. Be fairly simple collection here. There's something over there. What is that? I think that's an amethyst. Looks like it is. Yep. We got diglets in there. And the exit right there. Okay. I should definitely get the uh, the upgrade for that soon. Uh, topaz we already have one of. Amethysts. Yeah, I'll get rid of the cherry bomb for now. But let's get out of here. I am starting to get exhausted. So. Should be a fairly good haul as far as everything is concerned. We can sell the amethyst and the topaz for cash. And... I think we have enough coal to make another one of the, uh... The preservative jars. And from there, I think we are done for today. So I can also put down this calendar, so I can actually know what day it is. Which will be very, very helpful. Alright. Hello there, buddy. Go ahead and walk in here. Place down my calendar. Yep, this is the last day of spring. So... Go ahead and pop 
Oh, not all these in. Let's go ahead and hold on to those. I'll sell the quartz, amethyst, and topaz, and then go to sleep. Alright, so, thank you all for watching this episode of Stardew Valley. I hope you all have enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you all. Well, actually, first I should probably get all my money first. <laughs> I just gotta level up in combat. Alright. So, thank you all so much for watching this episode of Stardew Valley. I hope you all have enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you all in the next one. Goodbye, everybody!